Today me and Vitaly are making a quick video because we caved in on, on a long-standing diet. We had we had some milk and Wait, let's go. Let's go man. It's 10 30 exactly now. No, it feels like the gym is ours. It's so empty at this time. Sweet. Nice one. Nice one. At quarter past all the facilities closed, but that's exactly when me and Vitali went into the sauna and steam room and then we literally got asked at 22 minutes past 10 to leave. Asked politely to leave. After we were checked up on twice and told to leave. We caved in on, on a long-standing diet. We had... Uh, what's the name? What's the name of the bar? Eat Natural. Eat Natural. Well, it's full of shit. If you don't mind me swearing on your channel, man. I like to swear because it really what, what, gets it the called? point across. It's got it's bare got... palm oil, kernel oil, sugar, milk, whey. I look out for glucose syrup. I don't, when I see that shit, I, I avoid it. Why would you put more sugar in something that's already got natural sugar in it? Retarded. Look at yeah. this. What, what should we do? With it? You know what? Watch out. You know what? Feed us to the pigeons, man. This is this Even is the where pigeons it's going. Don't want that. This is where it's going. <laughs> oh no, man! Someone else to clean that up. <laughs> that's what I think about that food. It's not your food anymore. It's just dust. This. Is junk. Carnage. Oh god, make a, make a, make my Instagram picture. Come over, come over. Mate. That's like proper like. Vroom. I'll Instagram it. And we had that bar because there was there was nothing else that was natural and good. And I wanted to. I was hungry, you know. I didn't want to have any fruit because I've had fruit all day. So I thought, let me get a bar. And it's you know, nice and quick. Not worth it. Two seconds of pleasure. For what an hour of pain. Look, this thing's not. We're so bloated. Look at that. This is like pure. This is pure gas. Pure blow, pure he's gas. not actually, he's not as fat as he looks. <laughs> Trust me, he's bloated. Thank you for the compliment, Matthew. Wait, 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 wait. I'll show you, I'm bloated as well. I'm really bloated. Yeah. Why can't they put coconut milk or uh, something that is natural? <laughs> it just feels heavy. It feels gross, yeah, I can't even see the bloatiness. I'm not actually fat. I'm always getting it, mate. After this bar, look at that fucking gross nastiness. Gotta get rid of the glucose syrup and make coconut milk or some alternative for that uh, bar and but not add sugar when there's already natural sugar in the bar say again man say again so we can hear i, I missed the intro they have a lot of fruit juices with so just natural sugar and then add more sugar into it more glucose syrup why are you talking about juice man in dates i see like bars with dates which are like most naturally like have most sugar out of all fruits and they add more sugar in more glucose serious? syrup it's true isn't it it's retarded so basically so and i also had toasties with loads of cheese and and baked pork on gluten bread rolls. It was like my day in like after like eight months where I kind of caved in, I'm, I'm making some big decisions and I realized food is almost kind of my go-to when I'm feeling a bit low and that's really disgusting. So uh, for mm, me, I need it's to- It's like a comfort food, man. It's like yeah, a comfort yeah, food and yeah. that's, that's really wrong. It, it, just ha it just so happens that comfort food is most likely just you know, junk like Fatty carb. Cause do you know what happened? I had to like I had to steam my like my fish, my salmon yesterday, and all the vegetables, and that would take half an hour. But there was food at home, and I just mm. took it because it was easier. And instead of preparing my own, so this now I'm I'm going abroad to Thailand with Vitali. Yes, <laughs> I've been feeling this day. We've been discussing it, and today I have been feeling good. It's and, just opportunity, man. And I, I've been getting opportunity, opportunity. Having gone through Crohn's, I just want to prove that you can get through it naturally and. This is literally what I want to do with my life. And get a tan as well, man. Look, we look at pasty. Get a tan and, get a tan and have well. fun. Get, get a tan, but without health, there is no fun and there is no life. And that's what I've really gone through. I've been in hospital way too much at this age <laughs> and I have enough. So I'm gonna. When I saw this guy, like, what was it, two years ago, a year ago, he was like green. You saw this. This was just like skeleton, man. He looked like an old fucking man. It was gross. Me, me and my mate Ryan were just like, we were like, this is like, what's happening to this Sharp, guy? man, sharp, sharp. So it's, gross. it's true, it's yes. true. So this is a big fucking change. This is a big change compared to what he was two years but ago. But like, my, pills. yeah. Big, big change, man. But my point is, I want to become a yogi. I want to really just make sure that people don't have to go through the, some of the medications and side effects or possible death that I nearly went through. And uh, hopefully, We'll have a, a fun time getting there as well. <laughs> so not too serious, because it can get quite serious, because it will get serious. My point was, is it worth eating that gluten or that milk to feel crap and bloated? Is it worth it for, for five minutes of pleasure to, eat, bars, to get that texture? Is it worth feeling crap and bloated and thinking that you're going to become really ill? I don't think so. That's my main point. 
it's just so easy going into a shop they always try to manipulate you to buy loads of junk but well, this is what we're up against where's the junk food where's the junk food gluten 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 Matt, gluten Matt, this should Matt, be illegal this is the funny thing Matthew's like where's the junk food and then like it's everywhere yeah it's this everywhere this is junk this is junk what is madness stabilizers all right some good old water look where all the junk food is strategically put what can i buy what can i buy what can i buy what can i buy with food and diet and and sales it comes down to what's ethically right is it ethically right for junk food to be put at a discount right by the exit to the grocery store you come in every day it's not it's not ethically right sainsbury's it's a business though it's a business so it's a yeah it's a business it, money. it's a business but not they a business they care about your health they care about their pocket they shouldn't be they shouldn't be they should care about us as well and putting shit like that is really not fun not fun because a lot of people actually have a lot of chronic illnesses and think of it as normal but if you're putting junk food by the exit like that i mean what's going to happen supermarkets they're everywhere sainsbury's tesco are everywhere this is actually very disgusting by them and this is what has made people like me be in hospital as a kid and nearly die Check out my transformation video and me throwing tomatoes in the street fight at La Tomatina.